company can unlock the full potential of open source software and avoid the potential pitfalls through careful and intentional use of OSS. There are steps that a company can take to become more acquisition or investor ready from an OSS perspective, which can save a lot of time once a deal is identified. It's good to have in place an open source policy, strategy, or some sort of guidelines that govern the use of open source software in your organization. People often talk about blacklisting and whitelisting certain open source software as an example. Having processes around OSS helps companies take an intentional approach to the use of open source software. It also helps tackle certain license compatibility and software interoperability issues in connection with OSS. This should be a wider issue for the organisation and not just be left up to the developers. You should also be aware of security issues involved in open source. The specific open source software you use might not have a notification system for software updates or patches, so having an established process might also assist with security issues if you set out guidelines how releases and patches are to be managed. Companies need to try to have a complete picture where open source code is used um, throughout the business. By maintaining a written record and understanding of the conditions under which open source software is used and licensed, a company will be able to easily identify any potential risks to their intellectual property rights. It will also assist you to respond to diligence queries a lot faster. Make sure that third-party developers understand your open source processes and that they assign any IP they create and code they write to you. That is an important point generally, not just from an open source software perspective. Take measures to address any issues identified in the code base in anticipation of the deal. For example, code can be made available under other terms than under an OS license. This is a matter for negotiation and might allow you to sidestep some of the restrictive licensing issues. It probably goes without saying, but don't infringe open source software license terms.